Hey everyone, I'm Arabos here and welcome back to some more FTL Advanced Edition. So, let's do another run, shall we? I'm not quite sure what I want to play just yet. I know I want to play Type B of something. Just to get started on unlocks. We could just go for good old Kestrel Cruiser Type B or maybe for Federation Cruiser. Let's do Zoltan Cruiser Type B. Yep, sounds good. Let's do Zoltan Cruiser Type B. Alright, we have three Zoltan dudes, one in the weapon systems, one has to be the pilot and one in the engines. Sounds good to me, we have two Ion Blast weapons and Pike Beam. Not a bad weapon setup, I definitely don't mind. And we have four levels of weapon control, that's pretty good. Let's get started then, and the Zoltan shield is obviously pretty awesome. But the number one priority should be getting an actual proper shield. Because we do not have... Well, we do have one level of shields, but this is not enough to actually power up the shields. We need more, one more power bar in the shield systems. So that should be the number one priority. Let's start firing and disable his weapons. Yeah, I don't like that missile. Fortunately, we have our Zoltan shield. So the missiles can't actually hit us. Pike beam. This should do the trick. Quite easily, in fact, we can hit more than that. The pack beam is pretty good. Accept their offer. Seven missiles? No, not really. I want to get more money. More scraps in this case. So let's do exactly that. The Zoltan Cruiser is pretty good, that's for sure. And this weapon setup is actually pretty good. There are a lot of ships with far worse starting weapon setup. And we got some achievement actually, okay, whatever. Let's keep moving. Oh yeah, this might be enough money for the shields, I don't think it is. Alright. Will the Sun Flare go for the Zoltan shield? I'm actually not sure. We'll find out. Let's disable their weapons faster. Also, the nice thing about Ion Blast is that we'll get a lot of weapon experience fast. Okay, nice. Spike Beam time. Let's hit as many rooms as possible. Nice. He's trying to escape. I don't think so, buddy. I might actually accept their offer just to get out of here before the Sun Flare hits me. I have to wait for FTL drive to charge anyway. Okay, come on. Yeah, I think we'll get hit before we can jump. Nope, we won't. Let's get out of here then. Will we get fire? Zoltan, okay, let's do that. No. We didn't get any fires. That's good. Target the weapons and wait for the pike beam. I will probably keep most of these weapons. I'm not sure. I will definitely keep the pike beam. I will most likely replace the ion blasts with something else eventually. Okay, pike beam time. No, not this. Pike beam. And that will hit all these rooms. Very nice. I will not accept surrender. They are going down. And this should be enough scraps for shield upgrade. We just need one more power bar for the shields. At least we do have the shield module. The stealth cruiser, for example, starts without the shield module. And you have to spend 125 scraps at the store to actually buy the shield module. Anyway, oh, 100, okay. I guess we can't afford that just yet then. Alright, let's keep jumping. I thought that's going to be cheaper. But oh well, at least we are guaranteed to get it as soon as we get 100 scraps. Accept their bribe or attack the pirate. 10 scraps, 3 fuel, 2 missiles, do I want to accept their bribe? No, not really, I don't. We need more scraps than that. We should focus on the scraps right now. We have 14 fuel, so yeah, I, we, we don't need any bribes. And the missiles can't do any damage, as long as the Zoltan shield is up. So, pike beam time. We can probably hit a lot of systems here. Let's see. I do want to hit the weapons. Hmm. Let's try like that. That's five rooms. That's not too bad. I'm okay with that. At least we hit the weapons. One more round should do the trick. I could hit the other system, but I don't like that missile. Come on, almost there. Oh yeah, let's not use the pack beam yet. I need to make sure I will hit. Let's actually damage these systems. 
Accept a more generous bribe? I don't think so, buddy. You are going down. Give me all your scrubs instead. 14 scrubs? Okay, I thought we'll get more than that. Oh, there's a store in here, right. Do we want to sell anything? Probably not. Buy anything? No. I don't even need to buy the fuel. And there's another store right next to me. Hmm. Problem is, this store is not connected with this location, for example. I have to go to the store now. If I don't want to waste my jumps. We do have 57 scraps, so maybe this store will have something better. And it kind of will, but it won't. Ion Blast is exactly what we got. What about page 2? Shield Overcharger. Create single super shield barrier periodically, okay? Requires drone part to deploy. This is new. I do not have a drone system, however. I do not even have 60 scraps for this. There's a defense drone Mark 1. I like having that. I might actually buy the defense drone Mark 1. Maybe. Yes, I cannot use it right now, but I will get drone control eventually. It's tempting. I can't really buy anything else, unless I sell the pike beam and buy the halberd beam, which is not the worst idea ever. But there's nothing wrong with the pike beam. Halberd beam is just more powerful. Huh. Can I actually afford that? Yes, I can. I think we're going to do that. Okay, let's sell the pike beam and buy the halberd beam. The halberd beam is definitely much more powerful and I can still use it with one ion blast. I don't think I'm going to regret that decision. <laughs> okay, let's keep jumping. I'm actually quite happy about that halberd beam. Now we need more scraps to upgrade our shields. Still. Great. Empty location. I hate those. Give me something. Accept two fuel? Yeah, sure. Oh yeah, this is an escort quest. Fine. Distress signal. I can't really go there. I'm not sure if I can even finish this quest before the rebels catch me. We have to go to the exit. I think we'll have to fight the rebels if I want to complete this quest. Sell drone parts? I'll keep them. Okay, I don't think the rebels will catch us if we go here. Upgraded reactor. Well, that was worth it. Yeah, okay, that was definitely worth it. We, we wasted a few jumps, but that's okay. What now? Uncharted Nebula or Pirate Controlled? Let's go to the Nebula. We can stay here longer, because the Nebula slows down the rebels. Let's get started. We need to get a shield upgrade by the end of this sector. Attack the pirate, obviously. Alright, let's put the halberd beam to good use. That thing will do tons of damage. And the nice thing about Ion Blast is that we probably have decent experience in weapons already. Yep, we do. So, halberd beam. Alright, let's use it. We can hit the shield, the weapon, the engine and the oxygen. Yep, looks good to me and he's already going down. Ignore. We need more scraps. 16 scraps and repair birds. Okay, I guess that's fine. That might actually be useful. It uses one drone, I assume. Let's have a look. Equipment. Self-teleporting unit that flows the room with nanobots capable of completely repairing all system damage. Yeah, that's nice. Requires missile. I might actually keep it because that is quite nice and useful. Yeah, I think I'll keep that. Let's move. There's no store around here, so I'm not selling it just yet. I will sell one Ion Blast, most likely. Alright. I might... Oh, what? Why is Halberd Beam disabled? That was a little bit silly. Oh, that's because we only have half power. Right. So, we actually have to drain power. Which I don't like too much. How do we handle this? We might have to just... Jump? I don't want to drain all the power, because that's a really terrible idea. I can't even use the halberd beam unless I drain my oxygen. I suppose we can rely on the Zoltan shield. Okay, let's rely on the Zoltan shield, 
but we are currently using zero power in oxygen and that's not a great idea at least i can't sustain that for long we need to hit them hard as soon as halberd beam is charged up we are about to lose our zortan shield okay come on there we go it's down let's hit their weapons the cloning bay as many rooms as possible we can hit up to four rooms okay nice he's trying to jump oh great will the halberd beam charge up in time we need to disable their cockpit and their engines preferably yeah that halberd beam needs to charge faster come on don't fail me come on what oh yeah he's firing he's gone 24 scraps awesome yeah we are saving up for the shield that's for sure that's a no-brainer where to i don't really want to go through here i'd rather go through the nebulas so in this case through the middle or up here let's go up here doesn't really matter all that much anyone home yeah pirates pause so engines oxygen and yeah that's it we need one more weapon control to actually use two island blasts and halberd beam but i'm prioritizing the shield upgrade because that's really a lot more important the sultan shield is working fine but once we start fighting ships with more firepower the sultan shield won't be enough on its own in case that wasn't obvious so let's hit as many rooms as possible in this case four and the shield too very nice accept their offer no not really let's keep attacking hit their shield or their cockpit or both just waiting for the halberd beam now come on and he's down give me your scrubs 30 scrubs nice one more encounter and we should get 100 which will be enough for the shield upgrade i'll feel much more comfortable with the shields arm the weapons yeah arm the weapons these guys have some missiles oh yeah half power again all right so we have to rely on the zoltan shield again just drain all that power we can get oxygen by sending one zoltan guy but i'd rather keep them in these locations right now oh yeah should start using the ion blast so come on let's wait with that ion blast for the halberd beam now and halberd beam we can hit the oxygen the weapon the cockpit and shields sounds good to me and he's almost down one more round and he's going down now we could use our oxygen actually yeah we kind of need our oxygen where's the oxygen system yeah where's the oxygen system oh yeah right here next to the engines i'll just send that guy there to power it up and he's going down 100 scrams an ion blast awesome i can sell that because i don't need free ion blasts <laughs> definitely not okay let's upgrade right away we need one more power bar actually no we wanted the shields so let's grab the shield first at least now we can use the shield like at all and jump the rebels are coming i want to find a store if possible i'm not sure if that's going to happen or not let's go up here we are doing quite well so far attack the pirate now what about the power distribution we don't need to power up the shield just yet but well there's no reason not to i suppose we are doing quite well so far but zoltan cruiser is pretty strong in general one of the stronger ships overall for sure yeah the burst laser will burn through the zoltan shield pretty quickly but my halberd beam will burn through their systems even quicker awesome 
I have to say, I love beam weapons, especially the stronger ones. They are just so good. Yeah, this guy is screwed now. One more shot and he's going down. And how's our weapon experience? Very good. Very nice. And we got a hull beam, wow. Okay, this run is awesome so far. Now we need to find a store of some description. Like any store at all. Do we go through here? Or through here? I guess it doesn't make a big difference. Let's go through here. Maybe we'll find a store in that corner or something. Oh great, half power again. And that's an auto scout. Okay. If that's how it's going to work. Drain the oxygen, I suppose. We need to get some more power bars. That should be the next upgrade, I suppose. More power bars in general. At least one or two more reactor power. Oh yeah, they have missiles. Let's fire already. Actually, I should have waited for that halberd beam. But I can fire right now. Nice. One more shot and they will go down. Just need to keep their weapons down. I should be okay. Zoltan's shield is still at over 50%. And he's down. Give me your scraps. 22 scraps. Let's buy one reactor power because we're going to need that. And there's a store in the corner. So what we can do is... Go here, then to the store, then... Get to the exit through this location. Yep, that works. Let's do that. Should be fine. I don't think rebels will catch us anytime soon, not really. Attack and redistribute power a bit. Next thing I should buy is one more weapon control. So that we can actually use two ion blasts and halberd beam. We need some oxygen there. And more evasion, I suppose. Alright, oh yeah, they have a cloak, which is a little bit annoying. But whatever. They don't have any shields. Well, too bad for them, we can disable their cloak. We should probably disable their weapon first. But I don't want them to cloak again. And Halberd Beam is ready. Let's hit it like that. Well, that was quick. 17 scrubs and 13 scrubs. Wow, this run is going really well so far. I bet I just jinxed it. But maybe not. Distress signal. I don't want to go there yet. Oh yeah, we were supposed to go to the store. Right. We got 70 scraps. So, let's check page 2. Laser charger. This laser weapon can charge two times, giving it additional projectile. Okay. Oh, if you wait for it to charge twice... Then it can shoot twice, I get it. That's not what I need right now, really. The missiles are okay-ish, and we have 11. But I would be more tempted to get something more useful. Let's see, reverse ion field protects your ship from ion damage, giving it 50% chance to negate it entirely. I might buy this. Shield charge booster, boss shields... Ship, uh, boss ship's shield recharge rate by 15%. Yeah, I actually really like this. Let's buy that. And get some fuel. I don't think we need anything else. I will sell the Ion Blast. I will sell the Hull Beam. We have the Halberd Beam. We definitely don't need this. I will keep the second Ion Blast for now. And I will keep the Repair Burst. That leaves us with 69. I don't think I want clone bay because that repairs the med uh, that replaces the medical bay. I don't think I need the missiles. Hmm. This fires two missiles at the cost of one. That's not too bad, but it requires free power. Nah. I think I'll pass on that. Yeah, let's save our money for more shields actually. I could use one more level of shields, why not? Oh yeah, and I still want one more weapon control. Might as well just buy it now. Yeah, might as well buy it now and just use two iron blasts right away. There's no reason not to. Now, how many locations can we still explore? We could go here and then through here. I think we can go through that nebula and the rebels won't catch us. 
There won't be next time. Yeah, I agree. Alright, let's test this setup. Should be pretty damn good now. And this should be a ton of experience too. And this setup is actually good against ships with two shields, maybe even three shields. Yeah, should easily be good enough. And halberd beam time. Say goodbye to your weapons. Then your cockpit and your engines. And your entire ship. <laughs> That was nice. And distress signal again. Let's check it out. This was a really good sector for us. I'm quite happy with that. Give them the fuel. Oh yeah, I know this event. They can sometimes give you scrums. I'm not sure about every single outcome of this. Let's give them some fuel. 28 scrums. That was a very good deal. Can we still check that other distress signal? And not have to fight the rebels? I think so. Should be safe enough. Agree to trade. You look like a military vessel. We're trying to get back to our homes alive. I'm an engineer by trade and could try to improve your reactor. Hmm. I wouldn't mind some reactor improvements. We don't really need missiles and we don't need drones. Agreed. Nice. Upgraded the reactor by one. Well, that was a very good trade. That's for sure. I'm quite happy with that. So let's check that distress signal and get out of this sector. 24 scraps. Awesome. That was a fantastic sector. And we have 90 scraps at the end of it. Oh, what's this? We can hire a crew member. We could hire NG for 38. Maybe. I think NG is usually more expensive at the store and we could definitely use one. I think I'll hire an NG. We could use one guy for repairs. Okay, let's hire him. That's a pretty decent price. And he can stay, I don't know, right here. Next sector. That's going to be Uncharted Nebula or Zoltan Homewards. I think you can generally get more scraps from systems like this, like the Zoltan Homewards. So I might go there. On the other hand, Uncharted Nebula is also not bad. Because Nebula slows down the rebels. I think I'll just decide in the next part. So this one is done. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.